Hey everybody, Jake from Off Road Rodeo here. Uh, a few weeks ago I teased a video after my first accessory video about what I had in the box, what I was going to put on my 2021 Honda Trail. Basically what happened is I unboxed everything and I started to film like half of the video and realized one of the two accessories that I was sent was not for my Honda Trail but instead for a Honda Monkey. Uh, so basically what I have right here is the correct part. Uh, Bees Deals, shout out to them, they really hooked me up. Um, I let them know that I got sent the wrong part or that I had ordered the wrong part, whatever the mix up was, and they were real fast about getting the correct part out to me. I have opened this already to make sure that it was right, um, but it is, and I'm excited to put this on today. I'm going to show you what these are, and then we'll jump into maybe like a little time lapse of me. Uh, assembling them, talking about them, and then putting them on so that you can see. I think these are must-haves, so highly recommend, and let's jump into this. So here is what was in the original box and what was in the new box. Basically, I was on these deals and decided that this headlight is far too expensive and nice for me to end up falling and breaking. Um, so I decided that I was going to order this Revolution uh, high performance products, basically headlight guard. You can see it has these nice silver edges. It's real light, it's like stamped aluminum, um, but really super nice quality, really high attention to detail. It came actually um, without the silver pieces assembled. I've put all of those on. I haven't tightened it all down because like I said, I realized in the last one that I uh, had the wrong rack so essentially what happened was I was sent the rack for a uh, monkey and I have a Trail 125 so it wasn't going to work. Basically this rack is bigger and then the brackets for the sides uh, which I don't have in frame right now but they're also silver. Basically the brackets are too short and the spacing on the side of the monkey uh, headlight bucket is actually different than the CT125 so I had to get the right one. Bees Deals was really super cool. Again, shout out to them. They really hooked me up and I'm super excited to put these on and show you guys what they look like. So the idea behind buying this rack was basically, uh, I've been watching Some Guy Rides or Team CT125's uh, videos of the Transamerica Trail and I see that he's cruising with like a, a Harbor Freight, like small uh, Apache case on the front. And I have a GoPro, I have phone, electronics, you know. So I want to be able to keep those safe. So I wanted a way to mount another Apache case on the front of my motorcycle, like he did. Um, and he, I think he's using a different rack. Uh, but I've seen a couple other guys using these as well. Again, not this particular one, um, but uh, I'm sure there's other people out there using it. But basically the idea is I, I want to be able to carry some extra stuff. Uh, it'd be really good to strap a sleeping bag to, a case of beer, you know, whatever it may be. It has plenty of holes. The pre-drilled holes I thought would be great for the Apache case. And uh, just gives me a place maybe to use a bungee cord or like a cargo net. So that was just kind of the thought process behind that. I touched on why I got the headlight bucket just so I don't break anything. And so the bike looks a little cooler. Um, I mean, it's super cool as is, but... You know, always looking for ways to uh, kind of customize it and make it my own. So anyway, that was the reason I did this. And uh, let me just show you basically how everything goes together and tightens down. So there's a few tools you're going to see me using. I'll be using my Wera um, Allen keys here. Basically, it's a 1.5 through a 10 millimeter. Um, a lot of these are going to be like a three or four. Uh, on the back side, the nut is a seven millimeter. So I'm using a socket wrench here, just a Craftsman. Uh, and then right here, I'm using super lube just to make sure that uh, nothing uh, nothing seizes. Uh, this is heavy duty, dielectric, food grade, and clean. Um, and then if you read the back, it says, has excellent adhesion, impervious to salt water and road salt, long lasting. So I like to use this on bike stuff, so I figure I'll use it on this for anything that might seize, just to be safe. So now I'm just going to tighten this guy down, tighten all these bolts on the back here, and then we'll take a look at the finished product. I have this all tied 
type. There was actually a seven, there's an eight, and a 10 millimeter on the back of this, which is kind of weird, especially the seven. And then basically the small ones, so the one using a seven is using a 2.5 head. Uh, the, <laughs> the one using an eight is using a three millimeter head. And then the one using the 10 is using a four millimeter head. So I don't know how I feel about that, but it went together really well. It's real clean. Uh, feels very solid now that it's all together. All right, on to uh, on to the rack. So here's the finished product with all the bolts in. It looks really, really good. Uh, everything is super solid. Very impressed by it, honestly, for being like thin aluminum. Like these feel like maybe a little flimsy, but really like this outer circle, especially when it's attached to this plate, I mean, it just feels very, very sturdy. It's gonna look great on the uh, trail. And the rack too, oh my goodness. Like this is so solid. Very, very impressed. I really dig this. Bees Deals, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna post a link to Bees Deals, but I'm also gonna post my affiliate link on eBay for these guys. So if you want one, check the link below. Um, if you buy it through eBay, it helps out the channel. Uh, it lets me make cooler videos because I can buy better gear to do this. Um, all right, let's put it on the bike. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so I have it all attached now. You can see what it looks like. I think it looks fantastic. Really high quality. I'm really impressed. We'll bring it around front so you can see. Really super, super nice. I'm really excited to use this. So that's the finished product, everybody. Uh, I think it looks great. Um, definitely, definitely trust it in case I crash, and I'm really happy with it. Huge shout out to Bees Deals for hooking me up with the right one when I told them that I got the wrong one. Um, really appreciate that. Really super fast shipping. Like I said, I'm gonna put a link to this from my eBay affiliate thing. So if you want the same one that I have, uh, you can check out the link 
below. Make sure you like and subscribe, and thanks for tuning in, everybody. Stay tuned, there will be a giveaway for a Honda Monkey 125 rack and hardware. Um, gonna just give it away to somebody since I got it for free and Bees Deals didn't ask for it back. So, cool. Take care, everyone.